Hey guys, I'm going to be making a quick uh, two-in-one video right here, but first, before I start, um, go check out uh, youtube.com slash coolpicks s51 i'll have his link in the description that's a friend of mine um he completely redid his channel he's going to be making some unique and helpful iphone videos so please go check him out and subscribe he also has uh, a giveaway going on for a 32 gigabyte first gen ipod touch and some gift cards and it's totally legit i know this guy so uh go check him out and subscribe i will have his link in the description as for the video goes, I'm just going to show you guys a couple tricks that I found in Cydia. The first one is going to be called Music Mobile Music Player Flip. Now, this was like discontinued in firmware 2.x. Um, so, on 3.0, they re-added it to Cydia. And basically, what this does is it replaces your music and video icons, if you're on an iPod Touch, to an iPod icon, which is great because a lot of themes are designed for the iPhone, so they don't have icons for music and videos, but when you uh, replace that with iPod, they often have icon an icon for the iPod icon. So open up Cydia, that's all you have to do, and just search mobile, scroll down to the M's, mobile, mobile 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 music player flip it looks like that uh it's it's legit uh it's really easy you just install that you need winterboard um once you install that just open up winterboard and check off um mmp flip for 3.0 once you do that instead of having a music and video icon down here i don't know if you guys can see but i just have ipod and in the iPod icon, you see playlists, artists, songs, and then you have videos in there too included. I don't have any videos on my iPod because I don't really watch videos. But yeah, so you can replace those two icons with the one iPod icon. I thought that was pretty cool. Um, the next part of this video is going to be on this cool trick I found for uh, the iPod Touch or iPhone. Um, let's let this load up. It's basically called Supreme Preferences, and what it does is just adds adds so many more settings you can use with your iPod. Um, I really like it a lot, so just go open up Cydia, search Supreme. Uh, here we go. Supreme Preferences. Sorry. Supreme Preferences and Supreme Supreme Preferences Eye Touch. So the Supreme Preferences is for um, the iPhone, and the Supreme Preferences for the Eye Touch is for the iPod Touch, obviously. So I'm gonna open up that one. I already have it installed, and um, once you install that, uh, go ahead and go to your home screen, go to Winterboard, and check off Supreme Preferences. And once you do that, you'll see your settings icon has changed no matter what theme you're in. So you open up settings, and everything looks the same, right? Basically, everything is the same, except when you see general music video, you see supreme preferences. You have so much stuff here. Let's go into applications. You know, um, you have all these uh, application settings that you didn't have before. Usually, um, let's go to home. Uh, you can lock screen controls, hide battery on charter, reflective dock, um, website launcher, respring, status bar. You can change your carrier name and whatnot. Um, you can show your battery percentage, which I really like because that see it toggles on and off. You can see battery percentage up there, eighty percent. Um, just like make it mine, you can uh, you know change your carrier and the the uh, banner up here. Um, you can go in the system, you can select emoji, all that good stuff. So you have tons of extra settings in here. Um, that's just a quick, easy trick that I, should, I thought I'd show you guys. Um, this is a real quick video. Uh, thought I could get this out. Hopefully this will be helpful to you guys. Um, until next time, please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.